Hello, Fatality Workers. This is Black Flame from the Fatality Company. I am flying without wings, and welcome back to the Cavers Chronicles Black Flame Edition. Today, I'm crazy. Uh, we're going to be doing some terraforming, as you know I love to do if you've watched my servitor video of my old server that I used to play on. Oh, it's night time. I probably shouldn't be doing it at night time. I'm crazy, I don't care. I was actually supposed to be getting... Um, a certain Ryan on here to help me, but, um, yeah, I'm not sure if what happened, but for some reason he's not whitelisted, but, oh well, we'll figure it out later. Basic idea is going to be, I should probably do this the cheap and easy way of just placing dirt over the top of everything. In fact, yeah, I will do. I'm not going to be all fancy like I was with the old one. So more or less, I'm going to be doing this. As you can see. So I'm basically just going to be... Filling over all of the sand with... Uh, dirt. Which will slowly spread to grass. But of course I'm not going to do that on camera. But there is something we have to do on camera first. Yes, so as some of you may have noticed if you were paying attention just to the right of my screen. You'll notice that I'm lagging. No, that... Our friend Marek paid us a visit at one point, and he left me a little bit of a joke out the uh, front of my house that I was supposed to have recorded, but I forgot to, so I didn't. It was basically like a little toll booth that he made that said that I had to pay two diamonds to get into my base, and how come there's a blue sheep up there? How did you get out? What? There is no way for them to get out of that. I shan't let you live. I apologise. Anyway. Yeah, so we're going to go and... Um, get rid of this monstrosity in the only way I know how. And, yes, before anyone asks, this is actually my wall that he used to make this, but... I don't care. <laughs> Burn. I hear what? Okay, that's good enough. I ran out. <sighs> it smells beautiful. Hmm. It turns out I put away all my arrows uh, to hold dirt. It's unfortunate. Anyway, this next section is just going to be a quick time lapse thing. I don't know how fast I'm going to make it, but I'm just going to place all of this dirt down around here. Enjoy!
And look at that growth. I hope you actually enjoyed that. I mean, I've still got a bit of dirt left, but it's turning night time again, and I can't be bothered to stay out here. Well, yeah, you see the bits that I actually put down first. It's already spreading onto. And, you know, once I've dirtified most of this, I'm going to plant some trees around. And, you know, because to be honest, I find deserts a bit bland. That's why I'm doing this. You know, they just it's just sand and sand and sand and sand. The only reason I live here is because it doesn't rain. And as we all know, rain's really annoying. Yeah. I'm actually going to go and uh, get some saplings and plant some trees up there. You know, just... Although I'm not sure what kind of tree I want. I think I'm just going to make... Like, have a normal oak trees around. Just because, you know, they're... Nice and regular. Go and grab the oak saplings from the other bit. And just go and spam them around the dirt that I've already planted. Why so, like, many more oak saplings that came from that one? Oh, well. Wandering upstairs, like a boss. Ah, hole in the world. That's not good. Yeah, some, I don't know if you noticed in that sped up bit, but the seems to appear, there the seems to appear to be, there. That's not quite right at all, is it? There seems to be something wrong with, like, mob skins. Like, look at that. That's a zombie, but it's, like, really, um, messed up. It must be something to do with, like, the pre-release that we're in now, the 32. I'm lagging, like, really bad all of a sudden. What? Ah. What's happening? My frames, like, just dropped to one, man. That was really weird. sure what caused that <laughs> yeah I'm, I don't know what's up with the mobs in fact I'll be right back okay I've decided to switch back to default for the rest of this cause, just because of how messed up mob skins appear to be okay let's go and uh, start placing things that's okay then. I was about I thought for a second then it hadn't wasn't loading properly but it has of course, I'm going to go around. Have to go around here and light the th uh, yeah, light the place up afterwards because at the moment it's a bit um, that's bugging me. I've got to put the dirt here. Yeah. So I'm going to go for like a uh, foresty feel to this place. It's going to become a bit high maintenance, you know, with Enderman picking blocks up and revealing sand, but I think it'll look nice. You know, come on, it's, it's like the perfect thing for me. It's a forest, but it doesn't rain. It's awesome. Okay, spam some torches around to keep mobs away. Seems, of course, when I tore that it... Notice I wasn't just placing dirt on top of the sand, I was in places tearing the sand up and placing the dirt down it just depends on how it l looks i mean don't like the look of that at all that should be down you know i don't like the little bits just sticking out for no apparent reason at all just don't think it looks good okay so that's lit up down this way up and i imagine it would take a while for the grass to spread to all of this but you know will do eventually There's a cave down there. Hmm. See, because this bit looks like it's always been like this by this point. I mean, yeah, it fades a bit this way because it's going into a different biome, but... I don't think the uh, biome shade is going to make it that bad, to be honest. The only thing I'm thinking about is just here because it's kind of... Um, these sandstone stairs and the sandstone building. I think I'm going to keep them still sandstone and not actually change it to like, stone brick or anything. For one reason and one reason only, and that's that I am not tearing these walls down. They took way too long to build. I also um, need to change the glass again at some point. I just, once again, I've not got around to it yet. Is there anyone in here? No, I need to light this up. I always think to myself, you know, I need to go in there and light that up because things spawn in here, but I never got around to it. But now I have, yay. Okay, I'll think about what else to do. Oh, look, the Marek sign actually completely burnt out. Yay, I'll think about what to do next, and I'll be right back.
Okay, so now we're back in. Um, I went through here and I did this. Just because I think it looks better than it did before. Squared this off a bit more. I'm going to uh, change that wood to something at some point. I'm not sure what yet. And I'm going to get rid of this as well. I don't like that. Just a little off branch, but it seems we have a slimy little friend here. He took more shots than he should have Like a shooting range. Okay. Experience and cactus. Mm -hmm. I've still not actually made the pumpkin farm yet. I've hollowed the space out and everything, but just not been, not got around to actually designing it yet. I actually don't know what else to do for this episode. I've got another project in mind, but it's a bit... It's going to be a project that will take too long to just fit in this episode. Hmm. Chicken. You know what? Let's go exploring, just for the heck of it. I will mark down the coordinates of my base so that I can find my way back. And then we will head out. Luckily, I have my trusty notepad with me. But that was entertaining to watch me just stood still with F3 open. Oh, I'm Steve again. I hate being Steve. Oh well. Okay. This time, hopefully, uh, unlike the exploring for lily pads one, I won't just go in a big circle. Yeah, that wasn't exactly fun. I reckon I'm actually going to head off that way this time. I don't think I've actually been that way yet. Right. We can also head past my... Oh, look, a tree's grown. Isn't that good? Right. Yeah, we'll get to go past my reed farm while we're out here. I need to get some lily pads out here because my reed farm's like annoyingly unharvestable at the minute. I didn't like what I was, that I heard that was bad. Dodge through the reeds, try not to fall in near the water pits. See, that's why I need the lily pads because at the minute, every time you harvest the thing, you fall into the water if you're not careful enough. And the items themselves fall into the water. I should have known that it would be a snow biome this way. But the caves look lit up down there, or at least mostly. Hmm. So I wonder who's this way, unless of course it could just be my caves that I've explored. Ah, wall. I wasn't there a second ago. Oh. oh. Whose house is this? I, I forget every time whose house this is. Hmm. Got like a minecart thing though. And mushrooms. Can't forget the giant mushrooms. Right. So I'm going to head. Yeah, just keep heading this way. It's on F3. I can't never remember what the F direction actually mean. Yes, that's right. I am eating your brethren. Silly chicken. That's what he said to me, if you didn't hear. I don't know if you actually understand chicken or not. I see pumpkins up there. That was an absolute fail of a jump. <laughs> I think I probably would have done better if I'd just, like normal jump rather than sprint jumping. That's not a cave. That's a cave, jeez. That's not a knife. This is a knife. Yeah. That seems almost unnatural. What? Isn't that? It's like a big bowl cut out of the ground. Hmm. Odd. Ah, I'm falling. I'm failing at jumping up everything. Nice. At least I know that there's a, a uh, snow biome not too far away. Well, I already knew that. I mean, this one's closer than the other one was. 
Because it means that Kokomate will make an ice tray, a bit like the one that Etho has made in his LP, so that I don't have to destroy everything every time I want to get some ice. Well, this is interesting. Not. It's a bit of repeticism. That's not a word, but I'm sure you understand what I mean. <laughs> ah, repetism. Re repetition, that's the one. Ah, see, I got it in the end. Not repetitism. I'm sure you all understood that. If not, Google it. If you're saying Google what? Figure it out. Over the cow. Oh, yes. What a clearance. Go on, over the pig, over the pig. Oh, yes. Look at that. Ouch. <laughs> I need to actually get some of these cows to bring them up because I'm going to need a farm for leather at some point. Uh, if I'm going to make all the books and bookcases for my library. At least I know where to come and find some cows. This is actually, uh, when I first made my sheep farm, it was that way, like diagonal, for, uh, from a base that I went to find sheeps. There's plenty of cows out here, though. What biome am I in? Ice plains. Oh, so this is like a normal plains biome, but like a snow biome instead. I'm going to eat the one piece of bread I have on me. <laughs> Uh, ouch. Yeah, it's a painful. I actually, for once, because I've got my notepad with me, recorded down, you know, start time, when I need to finish, and things like that. But because of that uh, sped up bit, I still don't know. I would have stopped three minutes ago if that was right. But it obviously isn't. Oh dear. Uh, well, I found an ice lake. That should speed up my travels. Woo! <laughs> Shut up, cows. No one likes you. <laughs> Why are they so loud? When does the snow biome end? Jeez. It seems to go on forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. And ever. And maybe even and ever. And ever. This is my endeavour into the never ending snow biome. See, that was a segue and a half. <sighs> segue. I wish I had a segue. See, that was a segue as well. Segway from segway to segway. Ooh, didn't see that one coming. Yeah. Not really much to talk about. There's whiteness and whiteness and whiteness and whiteness. I'm going to gather snowballs. Two more. Yeah. Snowballs. Die pig. Oh my god, I killed it. It is. I hit it with a snowball so hard it fell through the earth. Try that again. Okay, that one didn't. I needed that pick. That, that, oh no, it's back again. Damn. Oh, I actually thought that I killed No, I didn't at all. I, I knew it was just a glitch. I'm not, I'm not that ridiculously unfit. Um, unfit. No, I am ridiculously unfair. I'm not that ridiculously unintelligent. To actually think that a single snowball could kill... Did, I, I'm pretty sure snowballs don't even do damage unless you throw them at, like, a... Um, blaze. Silly pigs. There's a lot of pigs out here. As well. Hmm. And, of course, the snow biome is still going on. I mean, how? Ah! I was just about to say, oh look, some cheaty snow, and then there's flipping somewhere I was going to stand to point out the cheaty snow. 
could be cows. Oh, I hit one of them. I could hear it. Okay. <sighs> white and white and white with splashes of lag and bluey green colour. Come on. See, this is the same reason I don't like deserts. It's all the same. I mean, yeah, fair enough, grass is, having it grass isn't that much better, but you can't really plant trees in a desert for no reason. Oh, look, a tiger biome. Die cow. Oh, wow, it killed it. <laughs> See, that was the cow going, no, because I killed his friend. See, cows care. Someone's going to find that tree when it grows up and one day and be like, what the heck? Wow. It's one of the uh, super reeds, isn't it? So that was seven higher than that. I imagine that, like, the tree grew and broke it or something. Oh, I'm taking it with me. I, I can remember on one of the worlds we saw once where there was one of them that was, like, literally sky limited. Because we'd been near it so long and it just kept growing. Hmm. More tiger, tiger, tiger. I think. Tiger. Yep. I am correct. I think that's how you pronounce that anyway. Tiger. Oh, dark lava. Isn't that lovely? You know, I keep getting the horrific paranoid feeling that I'm not actually recording audio. I hope I am, otherwise this would be kind of a waste. Shut up, chickens. What's that? Oh, I thought I saw orange down there, but I obviously didn't. Oh, I could have seen orange over here, I suppose. Well, that's more of a Bernie orange than a pumpkin orange like I thought I was going to say. Oh, well. I suppose I should probably stop recording soon. I'm getting rather lost. Never keep going. Okay, okay, conscience. I will. We, we, we jumping in. Oh, cheaty snow again. Cheaty snow. Oh, I only just made that. Are you? Boing, 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 boing. I'm boinging everywhere. Boingy, 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 boingy. Oh, and that's what she said. Boingy. <laughs> boingy, boingy, boingy. Boingy, boingy, boing. Over the flowers, over the grass, through the meadows. I was trying to think of something to rhyme, but the only thing that came into my head was, I'm so crass. Oh, dear. Self-demeaning. Na 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 Aw, come on, really? I've come all this way and all that's out here is an ocean. I should have brought a boat. Oh well, staring at the moonrise. I guess this is going to be the it for this episode. We're going to continue with terraforming, maybe next episode. But mostly we're going to move on to the super secret and musical project. So, until then, uh, until then next, guys. Bye.